Oh, it's a good one. Oh, I saw a spark. What's today, Wednesday? Yeah. Happy Wednesday. We're up and at them, loading up the yaks, having some coffee, and getting ready to head out onto the water. It's not as dark as it looks. The camera makes it look pitch black. Right now we have calm waters, but the wind is coming again. So we're gonna get out and get a few hours of calm and hopefully get on some big girls out there so stay tuned good morning folks 622 on wednesday we're back at it this is day three of the off-grid camping trip got a few good fish got limits on all my tournaments which is good I'm going to jump in. I'm going to pull it this way. Move these islands. Because I can't get in any other way. It's too far away. like a decent fish oh yeah that's not bad not bad at all to start the day tiny child get in the net in and out I gotta get those put on before they destroy my hands. Here comes a gator. He's probably thinking, oh, someone just caught breakfast. First fish of the day. She's a beauty. I know you can't see much, but thank you, fish. one. Dinkarooski. Come hither. Dink. I haven't caught many of those this trip. Not real dinks. Oh, they're all, they're just chomping the tiny child right now. Every cast I'm getting bumped or caught. That little dude. Oh yeah, I hate that. Wow, this bass is so light. He's golden. Look at the colors on him. He has big shoulders, too. He's golden. Thank you. <laughs> you gotta let go of me, though. Oh, this feels like a good one. 
Nope. He's a digging. Beautiful pattern on this guy. Oh, I lost my tiny child. It came off. That's a first. Nice fat bass. Thank you, fish. Nothing huge. It's a good one, though. He is pulling. Come here, fish. straightening my hooks on my rampola. Another nice, healthy Florida bass. Oh, a crappie. Woo, look at that. All right. You know how crappie are. They are nutso. Oh, I'm going to get it off. There's one. Okay, go ahead and slime my boat up. There we go. A beautiful crappie. I have my coffee with me. Mm. It's still scalding hot. like another crappie. Oh, it's a bluegill. Yeah, he was hitting. Oh, it's a copper nose. He was hitting like a bluegill. Look at the copper nose. That's my second bycatch today. Look how pretty that thing is. Look at that. Barely had him hook. Beautiful little fish. Thank you. That's a good fish.
That's how you keep them from jumping. Just keep rolling their head over. I caught a nice crappie. Nice bluegill too. Just a little dude. Little dude. Pretty rattlesnake. It's a tank. That's a big one. Rapala. a good probably 18 maybe 18 and a half I don't know what my smallest fish I think I need 18 or bigger he's mad he's 18.50 I'm sure I could use that Best fish of the day so far. Thank you, fish. Just a little pip squeak. Thank you, fish. Just a small, not tiny. Sorry about that. Oh, that's a good fish. Big one. Right. On Tiny child. Right. 
couldn't stop him from jumping. This is a wild kid. Probably close to three. Okay, folks, this is the last outing of the trip. I was going to stay one more night unplanned, but looking at the forecast, we got thunderstorms tomorrow, and I don't know what time. It says afternoon, but it actually looks like it could storm today. So I am packing it up and calling it a trip after I fish a couple more hours. So I'm going to hit traffic if I leave right now. So I might as well just fish until traffic is done. So hang tight. Let's see if we can get a few more in the boat. And a big congratulations to my friend Jo. She caught her PB today. And the funny thing is, when we set out this morning to start fishing, I told her she was going to catch a giant. And she sure did. She caught six pound, three ounce, old fish. Battle born, damaged and scarred and broken lip, but she was a giant. So congratulations to Joe. So let's get fish and see if we can catch a few more before the end of the day. Here he is. Now I'm done, pretty fish. Woo, see that? 